auditory diagnosis, quality of the voice. Quality of the voice. Apart from observing the emotional qualities, the volume, the flow of the conversation, we should also note other qualities in the voice. This will again reflect pattern of imbalance that have affected the voice and made it deviated from the norm. So we should always be thinking, what should I expect to be hearing and how does what I am actually hearing differ from this? What is the pathomechanism and could create this aberration? Gravely voice, gravely. Phlegm, especially phlegm heat in the lungs, will manifest with gravely voice. This is the typically bart fly and heavy smokers voice. Yan yung may mga naninigarilyo. So it is extreme. There will also be rattling sound and the truth and sticky cough. Cigarettes are dying and heating. They will damage lung in and gen generate lung phlegm heat. Alcohol will create phlegm and heat that can rise up to the lungs and the throat, affecting the vocal cords. Horse or husky voice. Invasion of wind heat, as well as a chronic heat and yin shoe condition will mean that throat and the vocal cords lack moisture and lubrication. So, nanunuyo. Again, alcohol and tobacco are often contributing of causative factors. Dry voice. A person with yin deficiency or sweso or blood deficiency will lack yin and blood moistening qualities. This can be heard in the voice, even though it is very subtle quality. Lack or lack thereof. Open elderly patient voices of this quality. Nasal voice. A voice should be clear and ring like a bell. If the bell is smoother, as when the sinus depending on the underlying May pusa akong sumasakay sa laptop. Istakato boys. <clears throat> uh, ang perfect example po na istakato itong signal. Putol-putol. Putol-putol na voice. Putol-putol na yung signal namin ni Dok. Eh. So some people have a staccato voice. Their voice sound like a machine, machine gun. When they talk, they do not necessarily talk quickly. But their words are clip and the voice is hard, sometimes even aggressive. Yung machine gun, di ba? Yung ganun, tapos biglang minsan stop po na puputol. This relates to the liver chi and its function of helping the chi and thereby the voice to flow freely and unhindered. So liver chi stagnation will also result a tendency to be irritable, which one will often hear the voice. So pag aggressive voice naman po, again, liver imbalances can give an aggressive or anger to the voice. Yan, pag mga stuck liver chi, yan laging <clears throat> aggressive voice. It may be a general tone or only heard when patients talk about certain subjects. Slurred voice. Phlegm can slur the voice. This is heard when people are drunk. And the intense heat and dampness of the alcohol result in the phlegm. It can, though, be a more chronic condition. So an extreme example is after a stroke work, wind phlegm has resulted in phlegm blocking the orifice, and the person has difficulty speaking, their voice being heavily slurred. Yung alis hindi natin maintindihan. Very soft voice. Pag may liver blood imbalance, can manifest with voice that 
lacks resonance. And the hard qualities that the liver gives to the boys. The boys will be too soft and will lack <clears throat> authority. And sleep, talking, talking to themselves in delirious speech. Ito po yung inano natin kanina. <clears throat> there are also some situation where the various form of sechi o yung sanilang sakit have affected the speech. But when are likely to experience this in the clinic, excess heat can agitate the shen at night when it should be calm resting in the heart. This can result in the person talking in their sleep. Shen can also become active when it's not rooted by heart deficiency or heart blood. Example, heart blood deficiency. In this case, the voice will be more quietly and tranquil. In some febrile disease, where heat has invaded the pericardium, the heat can agitate the shen so much that the person's speech is delirious and incompensable. Incomprehensible. Another sign the voice that usually isn't here in the clinic is people talking to themselves. When phlegm has black and orifice pieces of the heart and they are locked in their own world. This can be observed in the people who are mentally ill and hold conversation with themselves. <laughs> the content of pitch can sometimes be meaningless to outsiders. So sudden shout shouting scene and some types of Tourette syndrome. So this usually a sign of heat in the liver and heart. The sound of the person's voice. So ito po yung ating summary. Observation, loud, resonant voice. Significance, excess condition po yan. Quiet, soft voice, deficient condition. Pag horse voice po siya, invasion, of wind heat or wind dryness, liver or lung chi stagnation, phlegm, heat, blood stagnation, kidney indeficiency or lung indeficiency. <clears throat> Pag staccato voice po, yung parang nagpuputol-putol nga, or parang armalite na, parang baril. Liver chi stagnation po yan. Pag aggressive voice po, liver, excess liver condition. Shouting voice, Liver excess condition, dry voice, yin deficiency, gravely voice, phlegm, slurred voice, phlegm, nasal voice, phlegm or damp. Not only should we listen to what the patient says, but also to how they say it. It is important to listen to the heart and breathing. Take the blood pressure, height and weight, and etc. In all the time we spend the patient, we should be aware of their breathing, tapping in other sounds, clearing their throat, sniffing, groaning. I find more about their imbalanced state from this clue. Rather than from all their verbal complaints. So, observe po natin yung lahat na naririnig natin sa ating pasyente. Speech. Yun. So, pag fast and much heart yang excess po yan. Pag loud and aggressive, liver yang excess. Pag slow, halting, shaky voice, heart chi deficiency po yan. Pag rap or hoarse voice, heart chi deficiency. Pag soft voice, liver yang deficiency. Pag stammering, heart chi deficiency. Yang excess or liver yang deficiency. Is larynx speech, heart yang, or chi deficiency? Cup. Pag strong and urgent, lang yang excess. Pag dry and urgent, lang yin deficiency. 
yang excess pagwidlat of mucus lang damp stagnation so pagwik ko yung cup and soap so lang yung deficiency or chi deficiency breathing full noisy breathing lang yung excess or may damp stagnation pag ang breathing po ay dry squeaky sound obstructing breathing yung excess Pwede po siyang may bronchospasm. A person with a good heart chi will be able to communicate excellently with anyone, with or without the knowledge of their language. Another person who is very learned might still have a problem communicating simple messages to others. In communication, the expression is yang. The contents are yin. So those who are able to speak eloquently and unstop dramatically in a way that is enthralling to listen to and what's our heart young excess personalities. Their heart chi is abundant and if they cannot maintain talking in this way and continuing to inspire others, then the heart, blood, and yin are weak. So if their speech is full of empty eloquence and does not contain many ideas, it indicates the lack of substance and yin deficiency too. So yun, kung healthy yung heart ng kausap nyo, mas marami kayong matututunan. Pag unhealthy ang heart, wala. Yung parang kausap nyo, walang sense yung mga sinasabi. If a person has much to say but finish, it difficult to express themselves. It is indicate heart chi deficiency. Speech can be improved with practice, so through sa function. It's also increase one confidence, so yang function po yan. There are people who rumble on with nothing to say and whatever they do say. They say it badly. They contradict with self mix issue and have problem answering question. This is a leakage where both heart, blood, and chi are low and incontinent. Speech. So, pag paspo with many hand gesture, high voice, high chi, and yang deficient, ah, uh, yang excess. So, yun po yung pag nagkakausap pa yung ang daming galaw ng kamay. Para nang nagbibit. Devoid of information but entering. So, yun Deficient po yan. With much information as well, yin excess. Slow monotus, hesitant, robotic, yang deficient, si deficiency. Yung po ano? Verbos, rambling. So, yin deficiency po yan. Sobrang maingay, verbos. Yang deficiency or meron siyang leakage. The voice, the abduction and ab abduct, the abduction and adduction of the vocal cord is related to the tone of the voice, and therefore the heart yang and chi. So, pag high tone po ang kausap nyo, ayang excess yan, atas yung yan niya. Pag deep tone, yung deficient. Pag rap force, yun deficient. Pag weak voice, or my paralysis of vocal cords. Yin and yang, deficient po yan. Mababa. So, treatment, stammering. So, local points po yan, iron 23. And small intestine 17. Symptomatic points po ay ang do 20, pericardium 6, and lung 7. So, energy balancing points po. Ito po, makikita natin. So, pag hyperactive yang po, Ibig sabihin, mas mababa yung yin. Ang gamitin po natin ay heart 5. So, friend 14 and move point. Then, pag liver yin deficiency, so mababa yung yin, liver 3 or liver 5. Yan, natutuan yung 5 po kayo na. Chronic stammering is due to heart yin deficiency. It worsens when a person is anxious or nervous. So when heart yang increases, point heart 5 po. 
The loop connecting point is used to tonify yin and sedate the yang of the heart. When in the move point of heart pulls and calm the heart, point liberty is a symptomatic point against nervous. It may be, be altered with liver five, the loop connecting point. The liver five or loop connecting point po yun. Which also tonifies the yin and sedate the yang of the liver. Local points run 23 and small and 17, small intestine 17 are very useful and relaxing the tension of the tongue base. So you may problem po sa ano, no, sa mga dila. Kamitin po natin ito. Run 23 and small intestine 17. So <clears throat> two session po weekly, four, four times. One session weekly, four times din, one session fortnightly one time say so, may mga problema po dun sa tang sa mga tang base next is slurred speech and lisping so ang treatment po niyan ay REM 23 small intestine 17 distal point po ay third intestine 4 so yung energy balancing point po natin gumamit po tayo na urinary bladder 15 Ito kay SI-17. SI-7. <coughs> Nalalamigyan na ako dito sa aming ano. Maulan po masyado. So, heart blood stagnation. So, treatment. Pag liver G deficiency, urinary bladder 18 and cal bladder 43. Is larin. Lisping and speaking with the mouth closed are speech problem relating to heart G deficiency. This causes difficulties in being understood and acupuncture treatment can greatly help improve articulation. So yung slurring na po yung kanya, salita. So gamitin po natin ang urinary bladder 15, box your point of the heart, improve the function, then small intestine 7, look connecting po ng small intestine. So, ginagamit po yan to circulate the stagnation of yin and tonifying the yang, sedating the yin. Sisedate mo yung yin kasi sobra-sobra na siya. Liver points are used to improve the muscle movement. So, one to two session weekly po yan. Four, 14 session po. So, thank you po. Kahit istakato ang ating signal.